Assalamu alaikum and hi, I am Kornu Fazila Binti Bumaiso from SMK Tassusian Bombay and I am your physics teacher. Today we will continue our lesson on subtopic 5.2, Damping and Resonance. At first, the amplitude is high, and then as the time increases, the amplitude, which is the maximum displacement of the system from original position, is decreasing. Yes, it's decreasing, and eventually it will stop. All right, that is our first observation on the graph, and second observation, we can see that. The time taken for each oscillation of the same. Every system has its natural frequency, and when we say that the system is resonant, when it can influence to another system nearby to also vibrate to a high or maximum amplitude. So for now, I want you to download a free software.
frequency of the sound and also the different uh, musical chord. Either it is uh, flat or sharp. Okay, now I will demonstrate. So I have a wine glass here. So, okay. I have one glass and the chromatic tuner. So observe what happened. Okay. So we can see that it produced around 1,000, sorry, around 1,300 hertz. F. And the musical note is F6. Alright, now what happens if I add more water to the wine glass? Right? Would the frequency with the, be the same or it will change? Let's observe. So it produced around... 1,315 and the note is E6. Alright, now. Question. Right, question. How does a wine glass is singing. How does it produce sound? So the application, right? The handphone, the app, the smartphone application is a learning tool, right? So handphone is not only for communication, it is a learning tool to learn physics. Alright? Now I want you to think. Okay. How does a wine, a glass wine, produce sound? Does it have anything to do with vibration? What is vibrating? What is vibrating actually? Is the water vibrating? Or air around the wine glass? Alright, you have to think about it.